You are about to witness is magic. I have my freshly squeezed orange juice here. And here, I have my assorted delights. Why am I posting it on Facebook? Well, why does anyone post anything healthy they do? Because I'm a smug bastard. Let it go. So what do we have here? We've got some blueberries, um, some strawberries, red and yellow pepper. Uh, why am I putting them in? I'll tell you in a second. And an apple. Actually, the reason why is I'm fast. I wouldn't usually put them in, but I'm fasting tomorrow. There you go, more smug bastardness for me. Why am I telling you? I need you to hold me accountable. Right, let's see what's happening with this. Now, uh, yeah, so we were told it's not actually good to put too, maybe I can teach you something. It's not good to put too many different things in actually. Everyone tries to put everything in, but if you want maximum digestion, it's good to have only have two things in, like orange juice and something like apples. Or... One thing you do not do is put a banana in with orange juice because citrus fruits and fruits like bananas need a completely different environment to digest, opposite an opposite environment to digest. And if you have citrus fruit with a banana, you can't digest both. You only have one stomach. If you want to look at, find out more about that, you can look up fruit combining on Google and it will tell you what fruits you can combine and what you can't. So in here I have an acidic fruit as a base, which is the orange, the oranges, two oranges that I juiced. And everything else is Strawberries are also acidic. Everything else is a sub-acid. The blueberries and the apples. I'm not actually sure about the peppers. They are fruits though. People don't know that. Bell peppers are actually fruits. They've got seeds in them and shit. So, okay, let's see how this goes. Oh, I missed a secret ingredient. Oh, I love it how it compacts though when you give it a quick spin. That was fast. Sorry, I'm knocking stuff about. For those of you who have seen my last juicing video, I strongly recommend it. The secret ingredient. Now I just be like an idiot. I had everything prepared to gloat. Chlorella tablets. Broken cell wall chlorella. Okay, here's another thing. These are meant to remove heavy metals from your cells. The body is not meant to have anything in it that it's not made of. That means no heavy metals and no plastics. Obviously, the mineral form is good, um, but not the kind that we consider to be toxins. Although, mainstream people will tell you, oh, the livers and the kidneys remove all toxins from the bodies, but how much can they remove? If you put in more, then they can filter out. Over the long term, you know, they're filtering out 80% of what you put in a day over the long term, you're gonna end up with a less healthy body. Well, that's the logic of it. I'm not saying that I know for a fact that it's true. I'm just saying that's what they say. The other thing is this um, salty, crunchy spirulina, which I got in India. They say it's good for you. So I'm gonna believe them. It certainly can't do any harm. kept you on the line because you're probably wondering how it tastes. You didn't have to watch it. How does it go? Look at that colour. 
exquisite. I actually expected it to be a lot thicker than it was. I think the, you know, it really makes a difference if you, like, a lot of those fruits are like 80 something percent water. You know, if you use um, high 80s, if you use stuff like bananas, you know, they, they can get really thick, but this is quite a nice, nice texture. Thanks for watching. Highly recommend. Because of the peppers, it's not too sweet. Like sometimes, like yesterday, I just had all uh, raspberries and apple and the orange, and it was, it was quite sweet. So there you go. Highly recommend. This is my dinner, by the way. I'm not having anything else. And then not eating anything tomorrow, just drinking water.